Hello YouTube and LEGO fans, adult fan of LEGO UK here and welcome to yet another LEGO Star Wars Winter 2014 set review. So as you can see this is set 75041, the Vulture Droid, it's for ages 7 to 12, comes with a piece count of 205 and it retails here in the UK for 19, 19 pounds and 99 pence that's on the lego store or the lego store online okay guys so let's get straight into the review okay first of all a quick look at the box you can obviously see the vulture droid on the front there the minifigures that come with it one of these being a buzz droid so we have two new minifigures in this set or two new variants at least so spin that round so that we can see the rear of the box there we go so as always some of the features on the set are shown on the rear of the boxes on the side of the box there again just some of the minifigures and a picture of the vulture droid again nothing in that end nothing in that end and nothing much on that end apart from a picture of the vulture droid itself again so that's the box okay next up let's have a look at the instruction manual as we can see here so it's just one instruction manual for the set there's the front cover same design as the box rear standard rear on all our instruction manuals uh, inside rear cover um, some of the sets from the winter 2014 um, wave of sets and the minifigures that go with those sets some more lego.com styles information inventory piece count on yeah one page you can see there um, and we have a total of 51 pages um, 51 pages of build within the instruction manual again standard information there um, comes with two bags, two number bags, one and two, and it shows you there what's built in each bag. So that's our instructions. Okay, so let's have a look at the set and the minifigures. Right, there we go. So there we can see the um, Vulture Droid. Let's get that into a bit of a better shot. go so first of all let's take a look at these um, three minifigures okay so first up we have our little buzz droid we can take a look at him there you can see how he's made from all these separate Lego pieces okay and we have these two bits on the top here which are printed Okay, hopefully that's a good look at the buzz droid. Okay, next up we have our pilot battle droid. You can see there with his blue colour into the torso and that sand tanned colour also on the front section of that torso over top of the blue you can see there um, comes with a blaster pistol um, but obviously aside from the blue torso um, pretty much a standard battle droid so that is our pilot battle droid okay final minifigure and you'll have to uh, forgive my pronunciation of this I no doubt I've got this totally wrong but this is our Nemodian warrior I'm just going to call him the warrior. So we can see there he has uh, leg printing, his front torso printing. Go around to the rear, and you can see there the rear torso printing. He comes with this rifle. And he has this brown helmet. 
Let's remove that so you can have a better look at his face. There you go, there you can see that face print in detail. It is only single sided. Uh, but I'd say the printing is pretty good. Hopefully you can see those different colours there on his face coming out. And obviously that torso printing again. So that's our uh, warrior, as I'm going to call him. But yeah, pretty cool looking minifigure. Okay, next up is the Vulture Droid, and as you can see him standing there, that's in the walking mode. So I'm just going to bring this now to the camera. Okay, so like I said, that's in walking mode, and we simply, to get this into flying mode, these turn, like so, so we turn that one, and that one, not only that, these can be changed into lots of different angles and positions, as we can see there. Okay, so now we're in that position we can see some of the cannon detail here. And on this side. Um, this one again comes with the new spring loaded missiles. So you can see the ends of them there, there and there. And the other ends there and here, so that's you where you fire them from. So if you've been watching my previous um, reviews on some of the other new 2014 Star Wars sets you would have seen these being operated already but I'll just show you these firing again you just simply push down very lightly um, on this mechanism here and you will see this shoot out so I'm just trying to get this so that you can see it so I'm just going to fire this now hopefully you saw that and I didn't see where it went because these two come out very very fast so I'm just going to do the other side now. So that one's going to come out of here. I'll try and do it there at that angle actually. So and we're going to find now. They really do shoot out very, very fast actually. Okay. So if we now have a look at some of the detail on it, these are all stickers, unfortunately, I have to say. So that's a separate sticker there, and another sticker there, and it's same on all four of these sections on both sides. That's a total of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight stickers just there. Um, on here, we have more stickers, sticker there, sticker there, and a sticker there. So I believe that's all the stickers on the exterior of the Vulture Droid. Um, now the kind of cockpit area, I do quite like this design, is actually under here. So this just simply lifts up like so. You see that again? Down like that. And it lifts up like that. So we can see that there. And I nearly dropped it. Okay. And if we look there in the cockpit area, that's where our uh, pilot droid sits. You can see there the control panel, and that is another sticker. And obviously he sits in there and then the cockpit cover just closes down like so. So I'm just going to grab the pilot droid and show you what he's like inside. Right, okay, so let's grab our, first of all, open up the cockpit area. And I'm going to grab my pilot droid. If I turn it around that way and make it a bit easier. Okay, so he just simply sits down in there like so a bit difficult to get the angle on this but there we go there you can see him inside his cockpit area now and that just simply closes like that so that's now fully piloted with the pilot droid obviously ready to fly um, and like I said it can fly and then when it comes to land it can go into walking mode and again these just simply rotate round and same on the other side 
simply rotate round and so there we have it in the walking mode position okay okay there we go that's my review of this new set complete the vulture droid so like i said this is set to 75041 okay guys hope you enjoyed this review if you did please do go ahead and give it that um thumbs up that really does um help me um, and shows that you guys do appreciate what i am doing um Go ahead and leave me any feedback or questions, comments, etc. down in the comments section. If you haven't done so already, I would be grateful if you could please subscribe to my channel. And I look forward to seeing you all in the next video. Cheers!